The TypeScript and JavaScript PostFix completion extension lets you speed up your coding using PostFix snippet completions. Here I already have the extension installed, so let's take a look at what these snippet completions look like in action. So over in a TypeScript file, for example. Now, the basic idea of these PostFix snippet completions is that they change the order of how you're actually writing your code. So for example here, if I wanted to iterate through the views value here, I normally start by saying uh, for of here, use the for of snippet, and then I go and fill in the value that I want to iterate through. Now using this PostFix snippet completion extension instead, I'd start by saying the value that I'm interested in. So I said views here, and then I'm going to type a dot and say the operation that I actually want to perform on that value. So I'd say for of here, and I now accept the postfix snippet completion template here. Uh, so this is going to go and now apply a snippet completion. So it's doing the same template as before, but you can see it's already gone and automatically filled in the value of views here. Again, so we were starting with the value we're interested in and then applying a snippet to that value. Now I can just hit tab, go through here, and now I'm in the body of the snippet. I didn't have to fill in any, anything else. Now I can also use this for things like if statements. So let's say I was interested in testing something on item here. So I could say item.foo. And now if I wanted to actually uh, convert this into an if statement, I could say item.foo.if, use the postfix template here. And you can see, again, it's converted item.foo into an if statement. And I can even do the same. I can say uh, item.foo.return, for example. And I'll go and I'll actually apply that and convert that into a return statement. So you can use these postfix completions to just kind of speed up your coding and change the order of how you're actually thinking about things. Oftentimes, I find it's a lot more natural to start by thinking about the value that you're interested in and then uh, what operation you want to perform on that value instead of doing the snippet first and then filling in the values for that. Now, the postfix snippet completion extension has a bunch of other values in here. So let me just go through and you can see there's a whole table that actually lists out a bunch of these other uh, shorthands that you can use and many of them are quite helpful. So definitely take a look through this list. So that's just a quick look at the TypeScript and JavaScript postfix completion extension. Once you get used to using these snippets, it can certainly speed up your coding.